it's a new year. So I sit down with a new piece of paper and I start to make lists. Lists of things I have to do, things I ought to do, things I could do, things I want to do. And soon the lists fill the piece of paper, both sides. But I have a problem, you see. I have a monkey in my head. We all do, especially we creative types. It's that voice that that worries and criticizes and complains, the inner critic. He has opinions about everything I do and make, and he loves to distract me. So the monkey looks over the lists and he rubs his hands. He tells me that everything on these lists absolutely has to get done. He reminds me of last year's list of, of every box that I haven't checked yet. And he overshadows any of my accomplishments with uh, a glaring spotlight on all of my omissions and my neglected endeavors. He makes sure that those gigantic lists make my guts feel kind of liquid, make me feel so burdened that I can't take step one. Oh, and before I start, he says, I need a new computer keyboard. I need a new type of notebook for the new year. I need a whole box of fresh pens. Black? No. Blue. Ballpoint? Rollerball? Gel, maybe? He tells me that I should go and rent a hotel somewhere because life is kind of too busy here at home. Or maybe I should wait till the holidays when things slow down and then I can really get into it. Or maybe when I'm watching TV tonight, I could just have a notebook near me and I could scratch some stuff down. When we go on our next vacation, I'll bet I can do some really good thinking when I'm on horseback in the mountains. Or maybe, you know, I need to build a proper studio. Maybe a, a, an outbuilding in the garden with a nice view and, and perfect lighting and, and built-in Sono speakers. But the fact is, I don't need a horse or a he shed or a Mont Blanc diplomat fountain pen. I need to commit to my creativity and I need to get to work. I need to focus on the things that truly matter to me, to my goals in life, and I need to jump right in. I need to sit down at my old keyboard, at my plastic folding table, and I need to just write and think while I'm writing and eat lunch while I'm writing and maybe even eat dinner while I'm writing so that work can get done. Work that can lead me on new adventures. Work that might be risky, that I might fail at. Work that will help me to grow and to make me happy and fulfilled. There are a thousand things to do and a thousand reasons to delay doing them. But instead of crafting more lists and excuses and distractions, I'm going to devote all of my energy to creating the work. So here's my whole to-do list. Do it. The idea for this video started with one of the essays that I write every week. I write them just to send out to people who subscribe and they're free. And I do it for the same reason that I make YouTube videos because I have ideas and I really wanna share them with you. You can get my essays too if you'd like. Just go to dannysessays.com, tell me where you wanna get them and I'll start sending them to you this week. I hope you do. Thanks for listening.